Well, it was a news uh, that uh, brought a smile to not only the media who has been stationed here, but the uh, rest of the world. Uh, uh, this story shows the best of humanity coming together uh, for this common cause. This story could have been anywhere in the world, and uh, uh, it shows that uh, the world does come together and uh, faith is restored on humanity at last. Um, I have to say, uh, first time I was ever in Thailand was uh, 12 years ago because I was reporting uh, about tsunami three weeks and that was was total disaster a total disaster and us uh, usually you know big news happenings there are they are not very nice things well I I'm sure that I, that I felt like everybody else around here extremely excited very very happy hard to believe actually that they all got out so smoothly without any problems you know the team must have done something amazing all the planning seems to have worked how long you have been here reporting? Well, I have been just for two days. I arrived uh, on Monday morning uh, here in Thailand and, and I have been working since then uh, non-stop without sleep. But uh, it's been worth it because uh, finally we have this good story that uh, all the boys have been rescued, the boys, uh, uh, the 12 boys and the coach. And it seems uh, uh, they are the bravest team on earth and uh, uh, the coach is the bravest uh, coach on this planet. But this, uh, today I understood that this, this is maybe the first time that the disaster has a happy ending and everybody here are smiling, journalists as me and Thai people and every rescuers, every, everybody and it's very very special case that you have you have nice feelings after this kind of big news happening. Another helicopter going out now so I mean everybody's feeling the euphoria and the beautiful thing is I think that you know, everybody globally seems to be following this. Everybody seems to be rallying behind the rescuers here. Yeah, very exciting, very happy. Okay.